So I mean, the middle of my morning run. And this is a public time to talk about artificial intelligence. Now, many people are afraid of artificial intelligence. People talk about the uh, singularity, and yeah, some people argue that artificial intelligence systems might actually take over humanity, supersede us, and uh, on a more mundane level. Some people are afraid that suppose artificial intelligence would take away our jobs and we will be out of the jobs. And this Oxford paper by two researchers uh, proclaiming that uh, depending on jobs, uh, 50, 60, 70 percent of uh, the work would be done by artificial intelligence in the coming years, and which is a legitimate claim because you know in our work there are things that can be treated as computations and as far as their computations of course it can be done by computers and artificial intelligence and so on using statistical analysis and uh, big data sets and so on so that's not debatable that's something that goes with a nod but you know at, at the same time uh, i think it is uh you know this um crazy claim that by uh, artificial intelligence would overtake humanity is, is a bit of a hard fad and it is uh, you know doing a lot of disservice to uh, human society now and uh, I think it is really important to realize that human artificial intelligence systems are you know just tools that we use and also we like to live we like to live a better life and we can use artificial intelligence systems as our tools, not vice versa. I, it will never come to pass that artificial intelligence systems would use us humans as tools. It's not going to happen because they do not live. AIs do not live. That's a fact. Kim Mogi's morning run. So AIs are just tools. That's the reason why they are not lives. I mean, artificial life research probably are more profound than artificial indigenous research but artificial life systems uh, cannot be used as tools so life uh, cannot be used as tools you can use other humans to as a means to uh, enhance your lives i mean you can't just treat other human beings as your tools and that's what immanuel kant said uh, you should treat people as objectives and you know, artificial intelligence systems, they are not definitely not living, and that's why they are useful as tools. Um, so, you know, we should be aware of the fact that artificial intelligence systems do not live, and we live. That's an important point. We live, and we use artificial intelligence systems as our tools. So, with that thought, I keep my monitor.